everyone. Welcome to Zoe Home Inspired Living. I'm Rena. Today we are featuring carpets and area rugs. This has been months in the making as I slowly collected and curated different kinds of carpets and area rugs. These items are sold in my online store Zoe Home. So through the years, I have been selling carpets and area rugs in my online store because the the thought is my uh, Zoe Home store should be complete also with this offering on hand. So every now and then I find beautiful and unique area rugs which my customers really like and um, I am really selective in my um buying and selling of carpets and area rugs i avoid the you know the newer ones which you can find in other online stores big online stores like amazon or even here locally lazada and shopee i try to find um rugs from iran pakistan um here in central asia and also from saudi arabia like the car the persian carpets persian area rugs and also lately the french abasan rug which i really really love and i have now a handful of them which i am slowly and slowly collecting i am not at all an expert on these things carpets and area rugs but i am learning and while i am so inspired to collect them for my personal use and also to share through selling so i am also researching about them how they are made the patterns where they come from and the materials that are used to make these carpets and area rugs my very first Persian rug, which we used in the old house, it, it's, it was really beautiful. I still have it in the stock room, but because we have been changing our decor, and so it, now it is stored, and I am not at all ready to part with it. I got it from Hungary. It's Persian, it's quite big with French, and it's really, really elegant, and that's um, what I try to offer to my customers as well the ones that I personally like and I know that they will also like and love and use through the years in this um, small collection that I have carefully curated we can find um, Persian rugs from Saudi Arabia that have been used through the years but they still look lovely I found out that um, the true elegant carpets would last years and years and even generations and still they still look lovely even with uh, showing signs of wear they will sti still look lovely actually there are so many carpets now that can be found in amazon and from um, popular brands of carpets and rugs that they really um, distress the new carpets to make it very worn because that is very classy to look at. I wish that I could offer more, more vintage Persian rugs, more hand knotted ones, hand woven, because they are, these are so unique and so valuable and collectible. And I wish I could offer more Abusan rugs because my valuable customers have been messaging me. They want also Abusan rugs from France, but it is really, <laughs> hard to find them and so this um handful of rugs that i was able to curate i'm going to offer on my online store i hope that they will receive with love and so in this video we are going to show how an area rug transforms a room so we will be showing how they are used in the living room in the dining in the study or library or in any personal space like the bedroom or even the bathroom so i hope you will enjoy this video as we decorate and transform each room and area in the house using carpets and area rugs 
An area rug is much more than making a room look more beautiful, more eye-catching. It also defines a space. It sets the boundaries of a space or corner and highlights it from the rest of the house. It unifies the elements of a room. For example, the living room. It makes it look collected, gathered together, and exclusive. It also makes a room look cozy and comfortable, lived in. It's like it offers a warm welcome, like a cleansing exhale and a respite from a busy day. This is how the dining room looks like when there's no area rug under the dining set. Like so many other things that need to be adorned, it looks naked, bare. The dining set, which is, of course, the heart of the dining room, looks like it's floating. Now, the addition of an elegant rug makes a world of difference. It anchors the dining set so that it will be the focal point of the room. This is a Persian rug from Hungary, which I've had for a few years. It used to adorn our living room in the old house in town and country, but here we have changed the theme. Still, this exquisite Persian rug with prominent deep red colors makes this room look wonderful with the rest of the decor. This is a French Aubusson rug, and it's the second piece that I acquired just this year. I just love the profusion of beautiful embossed flowers all around the borders. They come very thick, and the luxurious wool makes the rug look velvety. This is what we are currently using in our dining room because I just love this French Aubusson rug. This is how our dining room looks like every day when I'm not creating tablescapes. Notice how the rug underneath hugs the dining set so that it looks collected and far more attractive than without it. This was how it looked like with my blue and white tablescape. If you missed that video, I'll put the link below. Again, this is the bedroom without the ornamentation of an area rug. It looks quite bare. Now, we will see the transformation when we add an area rug under the bed. Now, look at the transformation of this room with the addition of this French Aubusson rug. More pretty, yes, more attractive and pleasing to the eyes. This is the very first French Aubusson rug that I acquired and it's just so beautiful. I like it because it is embossed with flowers all around and it's very, very thick. Now we go to the balcony upstairs. This is the balcony that we dressed up for the decorating with candle holders video. This is a Persian hand-knotted silk area rug, which 
originated from Iran. It is crafted with silk and made by hand. And I like it because it doesn't have a fur or a pile, unlike most um, common carpets. This one is very thick and it is very suitable for outside use like the patio or the balcony. It's also very attractive since it's made and designed in blue and white and look at those closely knit flowers and all the elements that were put into this carpet. This will be available in my online store. This is a French Aubusson rug, which we put on the entryway, on the foyer, just at the foot of the brass console table and mirror. So this is one of the ways that we can accentuate a small space using an area rug. This is a vintage French Aubusson in golds with fringes and even though it shows some signs of wear but it still looks regal looks elegant it does make the entryway more interesting more attractive when you enter the house this is a belgian embossed area rug it is very thick and as you can see the elements the design are embossed and it's very soft or how about an area rug with delicate floral design like this One day when my husband went to work, I snuck into his den and put in this blues and beiges French Aubusson area rug and put in um, more elements, accents like that um, king size pillowcase. And I also added a plant and the silver candelabra with scented candlesticks. And when he arrived later on that day, oh, he just loved it. Placing an accent area rug in small rooms makes it look more spacious and comfortable. I love how this beautiful, small French Aubusson area rug accentuates my walk-in closet. It is just a very narrow space, but look how it really makes it more attractive. Of course, the bathroom is another space where we can accentuate it with an area rug like this wool hexagonal area rug that I put in to our bathroom and look how pretty it makes the bathroom look. Genuine lambs fur, sheepskin. Um, this 
this is perfect for accentuating the wardrobe like the walk-in closet or even the couch in the bedroom this is perfect to accentuate the floor like that uh, just below the couch This one here is a vintage Persian hallway rug that I got from a state sale. This is quite long, maybe 14 feet long. This is perfect for the hallway, of course, if you have hallways in your house. This will look good in there. This is a Persian area rug and it's made of 100% wool. Wow. Persian na Persian. And you can use this size, for example, in, uh, in the library or your office, home office. This particular Persian rug is fairly new, as you can see from the fringes. It's fairly new. And look at the design. So elegant. This is a vintage French Aubusson rug. It is large. It is 13 by 9 feet. And it has fringes on either end, and it is very, very thick. It is vintage. It shows signs of wear, but there is, of course, there are no holes. It's very thick, no stains either. But there, the the overall color is not uniform anymore. Um, I think there is also some. It's not really stained, but there's a discoloration over here. All right. And maybe some spots. It's not really noticeable. The design is um, oriental. And it's basically of natural earth colors. Like um, there is peach. Um, terracotta, beige, and the center is um, like gold or beige. It is 100% um, wool. It is very thick and it is decorated with flowers, peonies, and some um, Chinese elements. At the center, there is a medallion and surrounded by um, flowers and other oriental elements there. And then there are um, clusters of flowers scattered all around the center this is a very large 13 feet by 9 feet french abyssin rug very thick and heavy uh, which you can use for the living room or, or the dining room if you have a big dining set maybe this um eight to ten seater dining set this rug has been professionally cleaned by carpet cleaners and it's ready to use although this is vintage and it is well loved but it is still very thick and 
there is no really damage just signs of wear through the years this one it will still last for generations to come it is soft this is an elegant oh and so luxurious Romanian wool area rug and it's very large it will be perfect for your sala the living room oh yes this is just so elegant exquisite this is 100 percent virgin wool from romania handmade in romania and look at the details actually it's more luxurious looking more beautiful in person the colors are like gold matte gold and emerald green yes you can imagine this in the living room wow just so wow this kinds of you know very regal carpets and area rugs just transform a room like magic the color is deeper in person it's deeper yellows or golds and browns richer and deeper we just filmed a segment of my vintage nara furniture which will be offered in my online store and it also used my French Aubusson Louis XVI carpet area rug and now we are go I'm going to show you this super exquisite super regal and luxurious King Louis XVI French Aubusson rug this French Aubusson it is Louis XVI Fresh Abasan. Yes, that is the pattern exactly. It's Louis 16th French Abasan. So this is the one. Look how beautiful that is. Of course, this is vintage. It is just so hard to acquire a new one. Not only because it is it will be very, very expensive but also it's so hard to find them especially here in the philippines unless you import them so i got this louis 16th french abbasan rug and it's in very good condition although of course it's vintage it's not new but because French Aubusson rugs are very thick. There are no tears or holes or even stains. Look. French Aubusson rugs are made of 100% wool and they are very, very thick. And look at the embossing of flowers and very intricate design and there is a medallion at the center with borders of roses and those elements so this is called Louis Philip 16th French Aubusson area rug. French Aubusson rugs are really very rare and hard to find, especially in the Philippines. And so the few 
pieces that I have acquired. I have kept most of them, all of them for that matter. I haven't sold a single French Aubusson rug. I'm so pleased to introduce to you this Pakistani Bukhara rug that is 100% hand knotted, hand woven from Pakistan. This is an original Pakistani Bukhara rug and it's so rare according to my source. Um, it is pink. All right, we are going to read some information, additional information about Pakistani Bukhara rugs. Bukhara is a term commonly used to describe Teke-faced rugs. Teke was a tribe from the area of Bukhara in Central Asia. The design is dominated by rows of galls and surrounding geometric patterns. The Teke tribe is also thought to have incorporated some design aspects of the Salor tribe, also from the area of Bukhara in Central Asia. Some historians suggest that the Teke most likely vanquished the original Salor tribe and assimilated their designs. Today, Bukhara designed rugs are made across the carpet weaving world including Pakistan, Iran, India, Turkey, Afghanistan, and Central Asia. The term Pakistani Bukhara is used to describe modern teke faced rugs made in Pakistan, which are among the most popular handmade rugs in the world. Using a combination of New Zealand worsted and local Pakistani wool on a cotton base, the Pakistani Bukhara has a very soft and thick pine. Based on my research, no Pakistani Bukhara rug, um, hand woven, hand knotted rug, are the same. Because although they have certain patterns that they follow, but the shade, and the combination of the designs are different from one rug to another and it is in very good condition no issues at all no tears no stains no holes and it is perfectly preserved and also this color is very unique and rare it is Thank you so much for watching and I hope that you enjoyed the, today's video and I hope that I have inspired you to decorate your homes, your homes with carpets and area rugs. Um, you can find them on my online store. They need not be very expensive um, but you know you cannot help it when you are um, selling French Aubusson rugs, the 100% wool. The 100 wool and um very thick and also the hand woven rugs sometimes i can't help it can't be helped that they really become so expensive because they have been um, acquired uh, very pricey as well and but they will last for generations and your family will enjoy i hope and pray that you will continue to watch my videos the future ones and that um, you will not get tired watching and I hope that I am inspiring you in each offering and um, see you on next video thank you so much for subscribing and if you haven't um, subscribe yet please do so and hit that notification bell to never miss a post see you on next video thank you God bless